Matthew Doyle from Scaleform here again, welcoming you back to getting started with Click. In step 4, we'll add several new components, including video settings checkboxes, radio buttons, and a volume slider. Open the clickcomponents.fla file and copy a checkbox from the library panel. Return to the working FLA and paste the checkbox into the library. If the checkbox isn't already on the stage, drag it from the library onto the stage beneath the difficulty control. Give it an instance name of Bloom BTN. Enter Bloom in the label parameter on the component inspector. Drag another checkbox to the stage directly beneath the first one. Give the new checkbox an instance name of AA button. Enter anti-aliasing in the label parameter on the component inspector. Open the clickcomponents.fla file and copy a radio button from the library panel. Return to the original working FLA file and paste the radio button into the library. Drag a new radio button onto the stage below the second checkbox and slightly to the right of it. Give the new radio button an instance name of Edge AABTN. Enter Edge AA in the label parameter on the component inspector. Enter AA group in the group parameter. Drag a new radio button to the stage and place it directly beneath the first one. Give this radio button an instance name of HWAABTN. Enter hardware FSAA in the label parameter of the component inspector. Enter AA group in the group parameter. Drag a new label onto the stage and position it to the left of the first checkbox. Enter video settings in the text parameter of the component inspector. Open the clickcomponents.fla file again and this time copy a slider component from the library panel. Return to the original working FLA file and paste the slider into the library. Drag the slider onto the stage below the last radio button. Give it an instance name of Sound Slider. Drag another label onto the stage to the left of the sound slider. Enter volume in the text parameter of the component inspector. Save your progress and test the movie.